Uh, hello there people uh, This is mr. Critic and you're watching my LP of Panzer general So uh, the time has come you know for the final the greatest battle of uh, the entire game and also of this LP Cobra the allied break out from Normandy um, yeah, once again, you can see uh, what we are facing. Uh, I have studied uh, uh, this layout a lot, uh, so, you know, um, now I think I know uh, what I have to do, I hope, <laughs> you know. <laughs> um, I'm suddenly speechless. I wanted to say a couple of things. Uh, well, no, uh, actually in the previous video I said everything I wanted to say and perhaps only this. I will be doing uh, this scenario with baby steps. So for the first four, five, six turns I will be uh, doing uh, one uh, video per one turn, you know. Um, uh, but later, as we are starting to win this, <laughs> if, of course, uh, then I will do more than one turn uh, per video. So, yeah, this is it. So, time to do hidden units on, which means we cannot see the enemy and the enemy cannot see us. Animations on, <coughs> because I like watching, you know, those little things. <laughs> and now for the plan. Um, here, like I said, we will create a circle. Also, we'll keep our fighters nearby but not in range of the enemy units but you'll see uh, what I mean eventually so let us start here first let us do some damage okay now we retreat we also attack this tank no result and now we'll create a sort of a barrier you know um, which uh, when we get really lucky it lasts more than one turn but you know since you have seen what we are facing here um, yeah, luck is the factor here, actually. Now we'll bring this air defense closer. Um, also send Nashhorn here to assist. Air defense into the city of Mayan. And Panther A close to this air defense, so it is covered. Also, since I'm planning to do, well, I'm not sure actually, but perhaps after uh, this line of defense collapses, perhaps we can hold the enemy here, uh, near the city of Avrange. So, this is, you know... Here we're only buying time, you know, before the enemy reaches our victory objective of Nantes and we have some prestige to purchase um, anti-tanks. Uh, here these two units only have to retreat towards, you know, uh, the victory objectives, just in case if there are some um, enemy units that will bypass our defenses and then uh, 
no, not and then and bypass our defenses and uh, proceed uh, directly toward, uh, towards uh, victory objectives. Here also we need to bring inf here and also our panther a closer. <coughs> it is time to save this game. No longer crit, it is cobra. I am actually shaking by writing this down. Cobra. Okay, and uh, as I have already told you, I will create a sort of a strong point here around the city of Homflo by bringing naval warfare in the area and also purchasing an anti-tank. As you can see, we have 10 units available, which is actually, uh, you know, too many slots available. But the good thing is we will not have to disband any of our active units. So now this is a good strong point, you know, artillery, air defense, inf, entrenched and a rookie, but still a very powerful JP elephant. Also here, we will expose our anti-tank gun and also move this inf out of the range of this artillery. And of course give elite upgrade to, to this anti-tank gun, uh, which as you will see will be very useful since I expect it to be attacked by plenty of the enemy units. Now for this part here, I was thinking a lot about it and I have decided to do it like this. Now, first, we'll attack, we'll attack with the artillery. Very good, and then retreat. And also retreat this flag, since this priest has a range of 3 and can do a lot of damage to a soft target. But now for the part I was thinking whether or not you know to send um, our pioneers to destroy this inf or this inf here and after a lot of thinking I have decided to use uh, this inf. Now I'm not sure if this is the best option. I remember from the past that I was using pioneers just to you know, draw the enemy fire uh, to the pioneers uh, for being the expensive target, but I don't know. This should work too. Very nice. Uh, now we see more units, fireflies. Uh, you know, if we could, you know, disband a couple of enemy units, I would probably uh, opt it for the Fireflies. Um, even though the enemy air force is extremely dangerous, but Fireflies, you know, um, are basically the only unit, uh, this tank and I believe uh, the enemy has one more, the only unit that can mess with our heavy tanks and this is something I very much dislike. Uh, yeah, yeah. Now Panzer 4J will go here, Panther D will go here and now we'll also purchase an artillery to support our Panzer 4J since it is, you know, kind of a match for a Churchill and Comet, but no match for a Firefly. So we have to support it. Time to save the game on Cobra 002. And now I will take a pause. Oh, by the way, um, sorry for not uploading the introduction video yesterday I had some problems but you know I'm doing this third com this first combat uh, mission 
Saturday afternoon. So I think you had enough time, you know, to watch the introduction. Okay, now time for a little pause. I will be right back. Uh, yo, I'm back. Um, so also here we will bring our flag closer and put our paratroopers uh, on the airfield hex because they will serve as a bait or a sacrifice, whatever you prefer, to lure the enemy fighters in the area so we can, you know, destroy them with our flags. Speaking of flags, of course, we'll purchase another air defense immediately. Place it here. So it can cover, you know, this Nashhorn if it is attacked. And now for the very important part, we bring our Tiger 2 closer and also this anti-aircraft. So here we are preparing the killing zone for the enemy's aircraft. And also we are providing, you know, a safe haven for our anti-tank gun before, you know, we can get it out of the transport and, you know, make it a part of uh, the exterior of this circle, you know, to defend. Here we'll just attack and pull back. Okay. And since I know and you know it as well that there are artilleries in the area, I will also pull back this inf. Now for the Yacht Panzer, you can go here, Pioneers, nothing with you just yet, I believe we have moved, ah, ok, uh, this fighter has to fly somewhere, uh, you know, safe, not to be seen, so this is the place. So now we are only left with some units that we can, you know, um, give them over strength power. So why not? Air defense, inf, another inf. Um, yeah, why not? Fighters also. You fly here just to move. We have three more units. Uh, so we give a lead to these pioneers as well, hoping, you know, for some kind of a miracle for a rugged defense or something. Here also. And here. So this is basically it. Now we save this to Cobra 0. Zero 03 um, weather fair dry as for the units we can purchase later on when we have more prestige we have tiger 2 and also in the anti tank department we have um, JP elephant and Yacht Panther very useful when we will be forced to defend uh, this victory objective of NAND. But this is it. Now we give the enemy its turn. It will take some time. Then we'll finish this video. And if I feel like it, I will do another video today. Otherwise, tomorrow. Um, I know. You think, you know, it's just a game, but I find this really stressful since um, I hate losing in Panzer General and 
this scenario uh, you know was designed for the axis to lose um, casualties <laughs> why now because now we are actually winning uh, in casualties we have destroyed one infantry and with the transport and lost uh, none of our units but now this will change so I wanted to show you this uh, while we are still ahead <laughs> okay time to give the enemy its turn now basically the enemy will kick the shit out of our army but you know it is expected uh, if only you know these four units can hold back the enemy tanks uh, the enemy's tanks for one turn it would be excellent but it is highly unlikely okay this t bolt this time actually t bolt not t boat will be punished for this action and i'm always happy when the enemy is using Spitfires, you know, to attack our infantry and not our aircraft. No result, just perfect. Now, this Typhoon is getting a bit reckless. Excellent. Screw you. <laughs> Ow, ow, mosquito versus artillery, not good. Ouch. And he's actually st uh, bombing the empty city and spending one shot over the artillery to destroy the infantry with the strength of one. Come on, now some rugged defense, please. Okay, good. Rugged defense. Ah, fuck you. Please hold the line then. Excellent. Come on, artillery. I know it's a light artillery, but still, come on, do some damage. Yes, perfect. Ragged defense, maybe? Ah. I was hoping, you know, that this inf will survive, but no, surrendering. And now this artillery is gone. Well, not just yet, but firing at the same time do some damage okay rugged defense ah. but at least no damage was done which is always good come on punish this free french tank nah. rugged defense yes Up yours, you bastard! This was a firefly, actually. Oh, firing at the same time, not good. Come on! Ah, do not fire first, for goodness sake. Ah, oh, god damn it. I guess you win some, you lose some.
Okay. Let us check the map. Mm -hmm. We had some problems here. We have lost a very good um, anti-tank gun. But on the other hand, here we had some extremely good luck. And this Firefly is actually now ours. Will destroy it. So we can move here and attack. First, we can because this is an Achilles, you know. Um, it's actually very good against hard targets, extremely good actually, but pretty shitty against soft targets. And here we are also in a position to destroy this artillery, establish even a stronger line of defense. Uh, so yeah, this first turn was so-so. Ah, and now we have artilleries advancing. Shit. And we cannot even escape them. Let me just check for the aircraft. Okay, there are some Spitfires in the area. And we have three air defenses and one anti-aircraft. So we'll do some damage, no question about it. But okay, if this was a trade-off, you know, um, lose... Um, lose uh, uh, our 88 anti-tank gun and cripple the firefly I think it was a good deal not a perfect one but you know still okay um, this is it for the first video let us save it at Cobra 004 Perhaps later today, in the evening, I will do another video, but you know, since this uh, uh, Cobra scenario is extremely difficult, I will do one turn for one video. Sorry if you have expected anything else, um, no, you know. Um, even in Berlin I was doing one video per turn and this is much more difficult so okay good for the beginning nothing special uh, one two three four five okay our Nash horn is is also getting you know into action on the very next turn our Panther A here we'll have to come closer and nobody has attacked uh, this panther A here so we'll bring it closer and you know yeah uh, wasn't bad uh, I think I did save the game uh, yeah I did uh, uh, casualties <laughs> Now everything in the enemy's favor, of course. But we are only beginning. So, uh, okay. Uh, saying too much okay and this and that. But, uh, don't hold it against me because um, this is actually the, f the last scenario I, w I will do of Panzer General after it either retirement, you know, or proceeding to Panzer Corps or maybe Allied General if I find a good way to play it uh, not from um, from the mod of Panzer General forever but you know the original ok, now, enough is enough uh, thank you for watching this I hope to see you soon, all the best from Mr. Critic and bye bye.